We're in Windows Server 2019, the beta version. As you can see in the lower right-hand corner, I'm going to show you how to change the IP address. So let's right-click on where it has the network interface. Right and go to Open Network and Internet Settings. From here, we're going to scroll down a little bit. And we'll choose the Network and Sharing Center. And this all looks very familiar. Click on Change Adapter Settings. Right click and go to Properties. And from here we can change our IP address. So by default it's going to be set to automatic. So if we go to a command prompt, in this case we'll choose PowerShell, which is fine. Still gives us the command prompts that we need. We'll choose IP config. And we can see we need to have a gateway set up. And we can see our gateway is 15.1. So we've got to be on a, the 15 network in order to get this done. So we see a subnet mask of 3 times 255. So we'll have to be on that subnet. So let's ping an address and make sure we can't get to it. All right, so at this point it says probably can't, yep, can't get to it, so that's good. But if the firewall's turned down, we might still be doing an IP conflict. So we'll do R minus A and make sure it doesn't show up in the list. So I don't see that IP address in my list. So I can go ahead and use that. So we'll go change the uh, following IP address. There we go. Use the same gateway that was showing up in IP config. And we're going to point the DNS back to itself only because I'm going to be doing an upgrade to the uh, for to have this be a domain controller in my next video. All right, so when that's all done, we'll click OK, OK, and now we have a new IP address on our server.